Welcome, I'm Aaron Keller, Operations Manager for Resurgent Gear Australasia. Now, um, this is our first product review, so really in-house review, so I'm really excited about um, sharing this info with you. Now, this is a brand new blue skinny jean. Now, many years ago, we brought out the black skinny jeans and they just took off and we realized that we needed a blue uh, jean. Actually, a lot of our, our customers were crying out and saying, hey, where's the blue skinny jean? So this is it, and I'm really impressed with um, what um, Resurgence Head Office has done overseas. Now, these are a, um, a mid-rise. I'd almost class them a little bit above a mid-rise, between that mid-rise to high-rise. I'll um, insert some um, actual photos and you'll actually see what I mean. Now there are stretch denim, like any stretch denim, I highly recommend wearing a good quality leather belt that will just hold it to the waist because when you're sitting on the bike, it's going to pull from the knees and of course it's easier to slip. So I really high, highly recommend a good quality uh, leather belt. You got your two standard and quite deep pockets and also your two ones on the back. About six uh, belt loops, including the um, Resurgion Gear badge, which you can slip the the uh, leather belt under underneath and that really helps support them up. Uh, these are CE AAA certified jean. Now just to be aware that um, with CE AAA certification now you can get away what I believe and what I've read I'm just covering myself illegally is that apparently you can get away with um, just high impact zones now. Now the great thing about these, you're really getting bang for your buck because these are actually 80% line front and back uh, full coverage right down to about halfway on the shin. So that you really are getting high quality on gear. Now the great thing with PKEV is a lot stronger than other protective materials out there. Now the great thing about it also, it is actually thinner. And so it's not as heavy as a lot of um, brands. Now this, is, I'm, I'm not going to lie, it's still, uh, seeing it's got a liner inside, it's going to make it a bit heavier than your normal regular jeans. Now if you're like uh, up in Upper Queensland or even Sydney, it gets very, really hot at this time of year, then you might want to check out like the PKEV Light versions, like the Warriors or the PKEV Light uh, Dark Denim, denim uh, Dark Blue jeans. Now they use, since the peak of light, the, the, it's the CE AA certified jeans. It's just a little bit more thinner again. And then you got your Warriors, which is only 60% line, so a little bit more breathable. So uh, they're good options to check out. Otherwise, definitely check out our new wave single layer jeans, but sadly a lot of those are already sold out. And that's our best, uh, lightest pair in the AAA rated jean as well. Now back to these. Now, like I mentioned about five years ago with the peak of light, they um, used the Promodal Denim. Now, I never actually used that. Um, I never actually, I might have tried them on for like uh, photos, but I never actually wore them out on the uh, road because I preferred to wear the CE AAA uh, certified gear. Um, we only get up to, I'm in Hamilton, New Zealand, only gets up to around about 30 degrees and I, I still find that fine. So, um, so, these here, I'm talking about the um, Pro Model, sorry, I almost lost the track there. They're so, so soft, the denim, but also very, very stretchy. Hopefully you can see that on camera. And um, so if you're in between sizes, like sometimes you might wear a 32 or 34, definitely look at maybe to the 32, unless you've got real large thighs, but yeah, just because of that stretch. And um, I do wear, I said I've got large uh, thighs from my mountain bike um, days, mountain biking days. I do I still wear 34 in these and just wear a belt. Um, they class them as a skinny jean. I almost would actually class them as a slim because they have got a bit of room there to go over most motorcycle boots. You could always take that in if you wish to make it even more uh, of a skinny if you're going to tuck them inside your boot. Um, so I mentioned about the 80% line halfway down on the shin. They come with free D3O armor. Now the great thing about any of our jeans is it's adjustable. Now you can adjust it up and down because everyone's got different leg lengths. And like I'm actually a 30 inch inseam myself. And um, so it's easily taken up these jeans. It doesn't, it's not a problem at all. Now I'll give you a tip with the armor, D3O armor that it comes with free of charge. With them, I find I when I'm sitting down, they're gonna come up. So I actually put them just 
just a tad below so when I'm sitting on the bike they'll come up on my knees but off to the side as well because you're pushing out with your knees so that's another uh, great tip for yourselves um, we are in a lot of locations these genes actually themselves are in a lot of location locations already around Australia and New Zealand uh, definitely if you want to see where your closest store is go to either resurgentgear.com.au and on the home page there's a little drop of a house there click on that it'll bring up the store locations in Australia and also if you want to find about, out about the New Zealand ones it's resurgentgear.co.nz and it'll bring up a lot of locations we're going to look at changing that a bit because you don't want all these stores loading and it takes a bit of time so we'll look at um, maybe placing a map on there with a lot of um, flags or something so you can, you can just quickly click on your closer location. Now of, uh, if they're not close enough or not stocking your gear, they're more than likely going to order one, order some in for you to try on. Now if they aren't uh, that um, close then you're most welcome to uh, buy online. But definitely if you are close to a store, definitely support your local community, especially through these hard times and definitely want to support our, our retailers but you totally understand if you're not that close to a retailer now these are 34 by 30 uh, 34 waist by 32 leg as i mentioned now if you want to find out how to measure get your favorite jeans out lay them flat on the table and this front of the waistband will just go below the back and then just measure straight across now 34 inches would be 17 inches straight across you just double it so that's how you get the sizing but I'll insert, insert a um, how to measure um, icon so you can just um, pause it and you can see exactly what I mean. And then if you want to do the inseam, it's from the crutch right down to the um, bottom and that's, that's how you measure the inseam. So definitely uh, check out um, what, what um, uh, size that you need. Now we do have a warehouse uh, here in Hamilton, New Zealand. Uh, we don't, sorry, we don't allow um, people, we're more of a wholesaler. Now, if you're in the local community, definitely check out Boyd Motorcycles. They're really friendly. They've got these jeans in store, and uh, they come in 32 inseam or 34 inseam. We we'll go up to I think it's a 40. Actually, I think we're going to go up to a 42 very soon in waist. But at the moment, I think it's up to from a 30 waist to a 40. If you're over in Australia, we've got a um, warehouse over in Marucci Door Biker Life. Biker Life warehouses our, our stock. Definitely go in and see um, Mal and Marlene in Maruchidor, uh, Queensland. They'll certainly help you out. Otherwise, there's many locations around Australia. We're still looking for centres actually in, our, in the main centres over in Australia. Why we haven't gone to there? It's mainly because of um, we can't keep up with stock and um, looking at uh, locations. So if you have got a favourite store, go in and see them. And then um, they're more than likely we're going to order them in for you, hopefully uh, for yourself. Uh, so what are we, we talked about how comfortable the primordial denim is, um, they've got a wick liner on the inside, that's another thing to mention, that really helps with the airflow, just it keeps it a lot more cooler in the summer, and um, if you go for a slide that's going to help uh, protect you with that, especially with the abrasion on the road, you're going to, it's a massive amount of heat that you actually build up, and it's, a, it's amazing how much the peak of material, the protective material will actually absorb, and but that uh, wick liner just helps a little bit more so yes yeah, thank you for uh, watching our first um, product review and uh, like and subscribe and click that little bell button and um, yeah look forward to sharing a lot more great content with you very soon cheers for now